Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. So today is an exciting day because I'm going to be announcing the date that the baby is going to have her surgery. Um, so a little backstory, um, she is going to have to have a two part surgery. So the first part, she's not gonna get connected, but it's one step closer for her to be connected. And then the second surgery she has which should be a couple weeks after her first surgery, that is going to be her major surgery to connect both ends of her esophagus. So I know everybody has been waiting and we have finally been informed that her surgery date is, wait, let me think, <laughs> when is her surgery date? Oh, her surgery date, as long as everything goes smooth and there is no complications between now and then, is going to be February, 24th. So mark your calendars and that is the day that she's going to go into the OR and get, have her first part of her surgery. Um, so we are so excited. We have so many emotions, but ultimately we're excited and hopefully everything will come, come out smooth and there will be no complications. So we will tell you guys more about her surgery um, the week of the 21st because that is the week that will determine what type of surgery she does have. Um, they will need to test her heart. So the week of the 21st, they're gonna start testing her heart just to make sure that um, she is going to be able to handle the surgery and we'll have a meeting with her team that week and just discuss what the week looks like and what everything looks like moving forward um, until we're able to get her home. So we do have still a projected time frame. It's still going to be, they said about two months before she can come home after she has her surgery. So two months, um, hopefully she'll be home and um, we will not have to worry about her going back to the NICU or anything like that. Um, there's multiple things they have to do after she is connected. They'll have to do dilations and what the dilations, what that is, it is kind of like a balloon type thing that they put down her, her throat into her esophagus and where those two ends were connected, they puff up the balloon and they just dilate that area just so that, that area doesn't start to narrow after her connection. So, uh, but we'll go in more depth and stuff like that in a couple weeks whenever we have everything outlined with her team on um, what kind of surgery they're going to do and, and everything. But we have a date, so hopefully it doesn't change and hopefully that that is her date. Uh, so February 24th. So I will be wearing her Caroline Crew shirt. I'll show you guys. So I will be wearing my Caroline Crew shirt. Um, so if whoever has ordered one or bought one that one that they want to wear it that day, they can. If you want to wait until her big connection surgery, you can wait till that day. Um, I'm going to wear them both days just because it's a huge day. Um, for our family, both of those days are. So I am so excited and I cannot wait. It feels like we are so close to the end and we almost have her home and I am just, I cannot wait for that day. So make sure to like and subscribe. I am going to be recording the day of her surgery as much as I can and I will record her um, post-surgery as well and, and her recovery. So make sure you subscribe so you can stay up to date with when we post and push that ne bell notification button. So I will stop talking and I will be back next time.